We have one night booked at the Grand Baston Hotel in Folkestone tonight. It's a one star luxury hotel. <laughs> one star and luxury do not go together. Hi guys. Hello. Welcome back to our channel. I know it's been a little while, hasn't it? Yeah, that's right. We hope you missed us. Yeah, we've had a little break over the past couple of months, haven't yeah, we? Yeah. But we're back. Not breaking from each other. No. Just, uh, from, just from YouTube. The channel. <laughs> Plus it's summer, so we just wanted to have some time off. Yeah, as things were kind of opening up a bit, weren't they? With like COVID and stuff, we just kind of wanted to enjoy just life again. <laughs> and that's yeah. exactly what we're doing today. Yes. Yeah, so as you probably can tell by the title of today's video, so we're going to a one star hotel today. We're just gonna test it out see what it's like i mean we've seen a lot of reviews on this hotel haven't we online yeah they're really and, bad yeah some reviews have been like they stayed at the hotel and there was like 16 police officers or something when Running they stayed up. there it's probably a drug raid Running up the stairs um <laughs> what else did we see i laugh now but i won't be laughing when i'm there questionable cleanliness kind of yeah a lot of about negative comments about the hygiene of hygiene. the rooms, just poor customer service in general. Yeah, so we so wanted to go there and see, see if it's, if it's really that yeah. bad. Apparently it used to be a five star hotel, so mm. over the over the time it's just been degraded. Okay, okay let's, let's drive. <laughs> we both said that. This is an underground car park and... Oh, it's so tight. <laughs> oh, it's really busy. This looks I mean, horrible. Yeah, it's a bit depressing, isn't look it? look after anything. We can't even find a space. Great. How are you supposed to even reverse? Stuck. How are we supposed to get out of here? Stuck. Where do we park? Yeah, and where are we meant to park? It's very We're bad. doing like a... 20 point turn here. <laughs> I probably could have picked a better place to do this. We'll get back to you when we found a space. So we finally managed to find a parking space. Um, not actually at the hotel. It was really busy. I mean, it's got a big car park, but it, yes, yeah, it's, it's so busy that there's just no space. People were just parking anywhere. So we've actually found a car park sort of just over the road from the hotel so it's not very far but we're just trying to figure out how much it's going to cost and then we'll be able to check in and we'll try and film as much as we can when we're checking in but obviously we don't want to be too obvious so we'll catch you when we check in It's not the last minute, but just trying to get them out. But the hotel is still busy and we don't have enough. Okay, you did it in your night. Six floor. I can't get it up. The lift's not working. I want to go to floor six. Where are we going? We're on ten. The buttons don't work. What? We're on floor six. And there's three lifts that go from floor one to seven. Yeah. This is the fast speed lift that goes seven and above. Oh, right. So if you're pressing six, it won't stop at six because it's a fast lift. Right, okay. So you need to come out the lift and go yeah. in the other three that will take you to six. Oh, right. This is the only... Um, How did you work that one out? I've been here before. Oh. Oh. So we just went down for no reason. <laughs> Out of order. Out of order. Now we're stuck in the basement. Anyway, I think we'll take the stairs. <laughs> Alright, we'll take the stairs. So just, yeah. We have to go six flights there. Okay, so the lift doesn't work basically, so I'm going to take the stairs. I 
five, six floors. I'm <sighs> so out of breath. Oh, here we go. Here we are. There we go. What's the room going to be like? Oh, we've actually got like a CD. Have we? Oh my gosh, we have. I mean, the window, the windows could do with a clean, but. <laughs> Yeah. But yeah, we actually have a sea view. Whoa. It's quite nice. Okay, so first impressions of the room. The fact that we've got a sea view has definitely given it some points. The room's so, not too bad, to be honest. I mean, yeah. uh, it's, it's very basic. It's yeah, quite it's outdated. outdated. Yeah, it needs modernising. But but it's not like a horrible room. It's not depressing, I think, because it's so light as well. Yeah, there's a crack on the ceiling. Yeah, there's I hope there's a fall down in the night. It's got room for improvement. Yeah, TLC. And there's some stains here on the wall. Is it dusty? Has it been cleaned properly? I mean, to be fair. Get an iron. Yeah, usual standard stuff. Mining board. The toilet? So it's not like dusty really. It's, it's pretty clean. Yeah, I mean the toilet is a bit ugly. If I'm honest, this bathroom, the whole Dust bathroom. There, but... And when you flush the toilet, it's quite noisy. Found some dust on here. Around the ledges. Yeah, but generally. Generally speaking, the room isn't too it's bad. Better than we thought, it's definitely because, better than I thought. Just because we got a sea view, I think. No, I'm going to wash my hands. What's the tap like? Oh. Very noisy. Yeah. Very noisy uh, bathroom. Um, yeah, they gave us a bottle of water, yeah. some biscuits. I was quite surprised about that. Uh, yeah. Like for a one star hotel, I was not expecting biscuits and a bottle of water. So that's, yeah. that's pretty good. TV. So, room rating out of 10, what should oh, we say? I'd, I'd give it a 6. Yeah, I'd so would I, six. yeah. 6, yeah. 6 out of 10. Yeah, it's slightly better than we thought. Yeah, I think because what we were expecting was like awful, so we yeah, were, exactly. were pleasantly surprised at the moment. So we're gonna, I oh, think... there's a house in the middle of the sea. Look at that pink house over there, you see it? Oh yeah, it's like a shed. She said there was two restaurants in the hotel. Yeah, <laughs> she and she advised that we book. But yeah, but she also advised there are probably better restaurants nearby, like yeah. down the road, than yeah. the one she in the She was like, hotel. you'd get better food somewhere else. Yeah, we could maybe try the if breakfast. she's telling us not to. Yeah, we'll try the breakfast here. Oh, the price. So the price of this room was £45, which is really cheap. You know, you get what you pay for, basically. It's yeah. not like we spent £200 on this room, and hell no would I spend that <laughs> no, much. I'd want my money back. <laughs> We're just going to chill out here for a bit and then explore. Folkestone. Explore Folkestone. because the TV is on loud. Ah, oh, it's bright. And the bed's really uncomfortable. Oh, it's too bright. <laughs> the mattress is hard. It's hot. Yeah. I feel hot and... Yeah, there's nothing here to change the room temperature. It's just a mattress. It's the yeah. main thing. It's just too hot. Yeah, it's too noisy. I tried to tell them to keep it down, but they wouldn't. Shh! <laughs> Okay, so we managed to get through the night, although it was really difficult. <sighs> Let's just say I feel really tired and my body is broken this morning. <laughs> my back yeah. really aches. The bed was so uncomfortable. We're gonna go he go and head down for breakfast now and yeah, go and have see breakfast. See what that's like. Yeah. Hopefully, we won't get food poisoning. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, 
so that's the end of our uh, trip, our little holiday in Folkestone. Overall, um, it wasn't a great experience to be honest. I'm surprised we survived because at one point we were considering leaving in the middle of the night, like 3 a.m. just because we couldn't sleep. I was like thinking, oh, I'd love to be in my own bed right now. Yeah. yeah. And it was just so uncomfortable. Like it's probably one of the worst sleeps I've had. Yeah. Yeah. Well, at one point you were sleeping on the sofa. Yeah, I was sleeping on the, in the armchair yeah. and trying to get, to, which was actually at one point more comfortable than the bed, but then I just started to get a really sore back. So mm -hmm. I moved back to the bed and laid about three pillows on the bed to create another mattress, yeah. which helped a little bit. Yep. Yeah, I think because we were so tired, you know, we actually eventually fell asleep. But mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it was a long night. So we had breakfast this morning and uh, it was seven pounds fifty each basically an all-you-can-eat type breakfast yeah it's a buffet but there wasn't a lot of selection no. it was just um, just like your standard english fried breakfast. eggs yeah it was a lot of it was cold wasn't it yeah and there was some cereals but they were all like really basic like cornflakes you know rice krispies and they had some yogurt as well i had some strawberry yogurt which you saw they had a coffee machine which i thought oh we had actually have a coffee machine this might be good and then i drank it and it was yeah it was disgusting it was not a cappuccino it was like a black coffee <laughs> uh, yeah. It wasn't a cappuccino. I mean, at you all, could have put it, your own milk had in weird, afterwards. Had a weird aftertaste as well. You could have added more milk. Yeah, maybe, but you know, it's not what I expected it to be. If you're looking for a cheap holiday, it's a cheap look holiday, elsewhere. <laughs> but I feel like you could still get somewhere better for just the same price. Uh, we hope you enjoyed watching this video. Yep. If you did, then give the video a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Yeah, but until next time, take care and we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.